consider the graph of f of x. We're asked to solve f of x equals 0, f of x is greater than 0, and f of x is less than 0. So first, let's solve f of x is greater than 0. I'm sorry, equals 0. So here we're looking for the x-intercepts. I see 1, 2, 3 x-intercepts. So I would say that the solution to f of x equals 0 is the set containing negative 2, 1, and 5. Solve f of x is greater than 0. So literally, where on the curve is the function above the x-axis? So along this part of the curve that I'm marking in green, and along this part of the curve, So, what we think now is, well, what are the x values that made the function greater than 0? Well, they were the x values that were between those x-intercepts that we marked earlier. And so, we would say that the solution for f of x is greater than 0 would be the interval negative 2 to 1 union 1 to to 5. Notice that we cannot include 1 in that interval because when x is 1 the function is 0. Finally let's solve f of x is less than 0. The parts of the curve that are below the x-axis I'm marking in red And the x values associated with those points, I'm now marking on the axis. So writing those as intervals from negative infinity to negative 2, union 5 to infinity.